Hi, this is Derek Jordan. Welcome to the World Fusion Show, where we bring you the leading innovators in World Fusion music. Today, we are doing a special sampler show featuring some unreleased videos, recordings from our previous guests. And we are actually gonna feature seven of our guests on this show. This is sampler number six. Our first video today is with Mei Han. She grew up in mainland China during the Cultural Revolution. She is a teacher at Middle Tennessee State University and where she teaches Chinese music and culture. And um, we're gonna do a piece today um, on the show where she is playing the zheng, an ancient Chinese instrument, and I am playing electric violin with wah-wah.
Howard Levy is a longstanding member of the Flectones and Trio Globo. He is well known for expanding the range of the harmonica. Um, he uses a blues harp, but he's able to find all the other notes uh, on that instrument, which is amazing. He often plays the piano and the harmonica at the same time. In this next piece, he is doing that, playing piano and harmonica, and I am playing the Dumbek. Simba is a world beat band from the Brattleboro, Vermont area. And we are well known for playing these wonderful solstice parties. We've been together about 30 years. It's amazing. And this next piece, we uh, have most of the members. Uh, we have Dan DeWalt on trombone, Charlie Schneeweiss on trumpet, Bob Stabak on saxophone, Johnny Yuma on drums, Vim Auer on bass, and myself singing and playing keyboard. And we're doing a reggae song of mine called Peace.
Shalom Trio is a group that effortlessly combines Indian and Jewish music. The members are Jesse Reagan Mann on cello, Apik Mukherjee on sitar, and Renendra Das on tabla. We had a lot of fun playing together in the studio when they were here, and on this next piece I am playing kalimba. Our next video is with Senny Hunt. He was born in Sierra Leone and grew up there during the war. He was orphaned at a very young age, but eventually was adopted by a family in Concord, New Hampshire. 
He's a percussive guitarist and singer-songwriter and currently plays all over New England. I'm joining him on this next song, playing a chord shaker. This morning felt the weight on my chest Didn't want to wake, but my mind needed rest Can't see me walking for the rest of my life I lay here hoping you would save me again I felt the lonely light crawling back to me I fear it's nothing more than my reality You're all I've got between a house and a home I'll never leave you there, standing on your own So I close my eyes, as daylight dies I close my eyes So I close my eyes, as daylight dies I close my eyes Ooh, 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 ooh. Steve Gorn plays the Indian Bansuri flute and is considered by many to be the foremost non-Indian player of the Bansuri flute in the world. He is playing on this next piece though, he is playing a straight flute and I am joining him on the Udu.
Carpe Diem String Quartet has worked with many different styles of world music, and they always dive very deeply into the cultural nuances of each style. They performed a piece of mine, a World Fusion String Quartet, called Pan Afrique, which in six movements follows the story of the African slave trade. The piece also includes the steel pan, and the steel pan really exemplifies the creativity as it is a more recent invention in Trinidad um, by the African Africans who were there. Um, they were not allowed to play drums, so they invented the steel drum to overcome that limitation. So in this next piece, we're joined, uh, they're playing their traditional string quartet instruments. There's a steel pan player, Scott McConnell, and I am playing the congas. This is Derek Jordan. Hey, thanks for joining us today on the World Fusion Show. And, you know, go to Facebook and follow us. Check out our channel on YouTube and subscribe and our podcasts on iTunes and SoundCloud. And remember, think globally.
Listen locally and support independent music.